On a small island not far from Miami, Florida, just across the mangroves, where the water changes to capture every shade of blue and is so crystal clear you can see where pirate ships have gone aground, lies a hidden jewel called Key West. Key Westers have always watched the sunsets as far back as recorded history goes. But it was the free souls of the 60s who turned the docks into a kind of celebration time, paying homage to a spiritual belief in the sunset. Slowly, the sunset ritual, born of street culture, evolved. The sunset ritual has been institutionalized as a cultural event and is a big part of why people come to Key West. Key West's legal import are tourists. They are the ones fascinated with the street lifestyles and different values. For them, it is all part of the Key West show. Key West's Mallory Square is the most picturesque street theater in the world. Key West comes alive as daylight dies at Mallory Dock's nightly sunset celebration. In every country of the world, people have used nothing but the ground as a stage and the sky as a backdrop. For decades now, Mallory Square has been that stage for amateur and professional performers. Several of the performances are dangerous and should not be attempted. It's over here! Hi, my name is Don Little John. I'm known as the Fire Master here in Key West and basically all over the world. Uh, I hold the world record for fire blowing and uh, the, the Guinness Book of World Records, uh, not published but recorded because of the dangerous act. Uh, I learned by that uh, by accident actually in New Mexico, little boys were doing it over cars and 13 year old boys showed me how to do it. Since then I've uh, learned uh, how to contain the fuel so that I can hold the world's record of 4.1 seconds, a continuous flame continuously coming from the center of my face. Hello, this is me, Frank Simon, Key West, Florida, at the Mallory Square Sunset Celebration. This is the main place where I'm performing today. We call him, this is a sage uh, from uh, Budapest, Hungary. I'm in Key West 13 years, traveling with my show. Entertainers come from all over the world to perform here. Thank you, everybody. Welcome to the show. I'm so proud to see you out from my heart. I'm going to make you happy this afternoon. You have a fun, I have a fun. All right. <laughs>
My name is Pavla and I'm playing here viola. I'm from Czech Republic and I live now on the Big Pine Key. Before Christmas I moved just here. So and how I'm trying to make here some money. And what I'm trying to do is play in the restaurant too. So I hope my music is nice and people like it. Key West is well known for its party atmosphere, but it also offers a classical side. My name's Matic Paremski. I make things out of bamboo, mainly uh, didgeridoos and some flutes and pipes. They're all created here in Key West by myself. And uh, basically what I have here are all different types of bamboo, some grown here on the island, some that I get from Asia. And uh, what I do is I, uh, I carve them, I tune them, I teach people how to play. Basically uh, what you do is you just keep your lips loose make an airtight seal by pushing the mouthpiece against your lips and Mallory Square has attracted entertainers from around the world performing a variety of shows in a beautiful tropical setting performances can be as simple as juggling or as dangerous as the act of swallowing a razor sharp sword Okay, I'm Parrot Bill. We're down here at Mallory Square. Hello. Hello. I'll hold it up to her. There you go. <laughs> She's like half the girls in this town. Won't say hello unless they see the money. <laughs> Hi, my name is Rick Martin. I'm a sleight of hand magician. I'm from New York City. I moved to Key West so that I could participate in this nightly sunset celebration on Mallory Pier. There's all kinds of variety acts from all over the world that come down here and set up every night, entertain the tourists, and then pass the hat. That's how we make our money. This is my little dog, Chico. He's just a few weeks out of the dog pound, and he's learning to jump through hoops and walk on his hind legs. And he'll be getting into the show uh, as soon as he's ready to behave himself and not uh, pick a fight with all the big dogs. I've got one. Donna's got, wait, wait, no, we got right in the middle of the magic here. Donna's got one on the count of three. A little ball from my hand jumps into Donna's hand. From Donna's hand to my hand, they switched places. Did you feel it go? No. Well, it went before we left home. Watch, I'll switch them back. Oh, did you feel it jump back? I'm now holding yours, you're now holding mine. Well, well, I lost track. Wait a minute, what do you got open up there? Sir, would you hold these two, just like this one? Just like that, okay? Now turn your head and cough. <laughs> Watch, from my hand. 
vibrations make it jump right under the ball. The great Roncini has been providing entertainment to the tourists for over five years on Mallory Square. His escape show is one of the favorite acts on the pier. He's bound by a straitjacket, chains, and handcuffs. And yes, you have to see it to believe it. star of this next act. As you can see, he's arriving in style with his own chauffeur. Well, my name is Jeep Calouette. I'm from Aspen, Colorado in the summertime and Key West, Florida in the wintertime. I've been working here 13 years and it's a good place to work. I play music here. I've done uh, White Face Clown here and now I do a, a variety act with my dog Mo. And uh, it's kind of a takeoff of all the shows on the pier. I, I can do a, a little bit of everybody's show on the pier, so I put a show together and I do a little bit of everybody's show. And it's a lot of fun. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, this is Julie. Now, Julie comes to us all the way from New Jersey. She can come down with these guys right here. Uh, uh, but now, Julie has never, ever been in show business before. You know, I can't think of a really better place to break into show business than right here in Key West, Florida. So please welcome Julie into show business with a real nice warm welcome today. Okay, Julie. Okay, here we go. Now, Julie, you know this here. I have a scarf in this hand and a scarf in this hand. Could I get you to tie these two scarves together, please? Okay, we got these tied together really good and tight here. Now, watch really close. You see, I'm going to fold this just like this. Ta-da! My name's Robert. I'm from the state of Kentucky. Been here, this is my third season. 
Uh, started doing the broken bottles because I was like 15 years in martial arts. Uh, the martial arts I took was weaponry. It shows when you get cut to slow yourself so you don't bleed to death. Coincidence. If you slow yourself enough, the glass will mold to you instead of piercing your skin. Uh, it's a real quick show, real good show. I broke a world record last year on this pier. I had 1,200 pounds on me while I was sandwiched in broken bottles. Uh, spring break's here this year. I love the spring break. The kids always come. They don't always have a lot of money, but they always have one dollar. Get a hundred of them around you with one dollar, you get a hundred dollar bill. It's a good thing. I'm Steve Bogger. I was raised on Simon Street in Key West, Florida. And I'll tell you what, you think it ain't fun here? Well, let's talk a little bit about what people do. We drink rum. When the sunset celebration ends, enjoy an island night of entertainment at one of the many famous bars or dine in one of the many outdoor restaurants. The choice is yours. Sample local favorites like conch, crawfish, shrimp, and native fish. And what would Key West be without Margaritaville? The entertainment is not only limited to Mallory Square. The beaches and seas surrounding the island are a tropical paradise with another set of entertainers. Welcome to the Florida Keys. We're here in beautiful, beautiful Key West at Smathers Beach, filled with good-looking people. And we're trying our best to, to keep them satisfied and make them enjoy their stay as much as possible. We've got a, uh, a wonderful list of tropical drinks for you folks to come down and enjoy and of course the weather couldn't be better. We've uh, been down here about 12 years and we wanted to make our living on the water but couldn't quite make it that far but we're very close to it and having a tremendous time thanks to you guys and uh, we hope you come down and see us real soon. Sometimes you can entertain yourself it may be snorkeling, fishing, sailing, soaking up rays, or playing a friendly game of volleyball. But don't forget about the ongoing sunset celebration and the Key West entertainers. Please, ladies and gentlemen, kids, I want to hear you count. If I pass 10, Encourage me like this to make 15. If you see I'm trying to pass 15, tell me stop, I might be tired. Everybody come. Show your legs over. 
grab here, spring break, bend over, tuck your head, okay? It's physical education. I know you know. Draw your leg. Boy, I got a wonderful crowd. I want you to come over here. Now watch me carefully. You're gonna take your right hand, you're gonna grab it here. See where I'm grabbing it? Not like this, like this. Take your left hand, you're gonna grab it here, straight over the young lady's back like this. Stand right there. I'm gonna run real fast, jumping from here, swing. I'm gonna fly through the hula hoop over the young lady's head, landing on the other side, on this hard concrete, risking my life for your amusement. Everybody go, oh. Bring up for one second, raise up, darling. I want you to look around and see all those nice faces. Look at your friends one more time. <laughs> look at me, take a deep breath. Might be your last. My name is Joseph. I'm coming from Hungary, Budapest, and I've been statue almost seven, eight years. But in in the USA, uh, almost two years here. So the first time you say I'm still there. Hey, Will Soto here. Hi, kids. This is Dwayne Scott over here. Can you get him in? Hey, Dwayne, come over here and wave a little bit. We probably work harder than any two people in the world trying to stay out of a regular job, but as you see, we're down here. This is our office, having a pretty good time. This is my 22nd year performing on Mallory Square. And hey, you know, what's not to like? Well, you know, we got our little outpost down here in the Keys. It's a little different than it used to be. It was, uh, I would say, probably 20. 25 years ago when we first came here, Key West was a little uh, outpost. It was more like a frontier town. These days, as things have changed a little bit, you know, uh, we got sort of discovered. And, um, I don't want to say anything derogatory about franchises. <laughs> but hey, there's still a few of us hiding out down here, you know? We got a few outlaws, we got a few pirate ships. It's still the American Caribbean. <laughs> Make it 
is it doesn't really matter what year it is or where you live. The only thing that makes the party live tonight is the live people at the party tonight. That's you guys. So we're going to do one with you. I'll be the dancer. You're the rhythm section. Wayne's going to lead the band. When the sun finally sinks below the horizon, you can bet the performers of Key West are waiting with anticipation for another tropical day in paradise and yet another sunset celebration. If you would like to order a copy of this program, please call Outlaw Golf Productions at 1-800-631-7506 or check out our website at www.tvchannel.com. <laughs>